Hi everyone, it's me Daisy and welcome to my channel. For today's episode, I'm going to make some chicken gnocchi soup. It's very delicious and comforting. It's easy and simple to make with lots of veggies. You can use either fresh or leftover chicken. It's great for cold or rainy days when you want something warm and comforting with lots of flavors. So what are we waiting for? Let's get started! And here are the ingredients that we need. 250 grams chicken breast fillet, 250 grams gnocchi, 600 ml chicken broth, 250 ml cooking cream, 1 tablespoon cornstarch, 1 half medium onion, 1 small carrot, 1 stick celery, 2 cloves garlic, 100 grams fresh spinach, 2 tablespoon olive oil, a few dashes of salt, 1 half teaspoon ground black pepper, 1 half teaspoon Italian seasoning, and fresh grated parmesan cheese. To start, trim the root ends of the spinach and set aside. Peel the celery and carrots. Chop the celery and dice carrot and set aside. Next, peel the garlic and onion. Dice the onion and mince the garlic and set aside. Cut the chicken into bite-sized pieces and set aside. In a small bowl, add cornstarch and a tablespoon of cooking cream. Mix it until it completely dissolves 
and there is no lumps. and set aside heat the pan on medium heat and add one tablespoon olive oil add the chicken and saute Add a few dashes of salt and cook until it's cooked through. And set aside. With the same pan, add the remaining oil. Add the onion. carrots and celery stir to mix then add the garlic and stir saute until the onion is translucent but not brown Add the chicken broth Cover and let it boil for 5 minutes Add Italian seasoning Black pepper And a few dashes of salt Remember, just add the salt if it's necessary Depending how salty your broth is Then, add the chicken Stir to mix. Leave uncovered and let it simmer for 3 minutes. Add cooking cream and cornstarch. Stir to mix. You can always adjust the measurement of the cornstarch if you want it to be thicker. Cover and let it simmer for 2 minutes. Remove the lid. and add the gnocchi cook for two minutes or follow the instructions on your package 
will know if the gnocchi is cooked when it floats. Turn down the heat to low heat. Add the spinach by batch and let it wilt first before adding the next batch. Transfer to a serving dish and garnish with parmesan cheese. Serve and enjoy! Thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed the video and if you like it please hit the like icon leave a comment and share and if you haven't subscribed yet make sure you subscribe and hit the bell icon for you to be notified when i upload a new video and if you want to know the full details of the recipe just click the description box below thank you and bye bye